Shaquille Barrett, Colorado State. Jamel Dean, Auburn. Antoine Winfield Jr., Minnesota. Ryan Neal, SIU. Carlton Davis, Auburn. And it was Kalijah Kansi, the rookie in there from Pitt, who got his hand up and knocked it down, and it's three and out. White, first down Rashad White, and more. Through the line, into the secondary, White. It's around the 44-yard line, so a nice gain. Could be a difference maker in this one. Second down, Baker in trouble and goes down. Mayfield sacked by Melifonwu from Syracuse. Of his success the last month of the season. Third and 17, Lions bring three. Mayfield in the middle, deflected and intercepted. Into the hands of C.J. Gardner-Johnson. Stays alive, out of bounds, at the 40. Later in play caller out there. Second and 10, five to the pattern for Goff, goes in the middle, it's complete. At the 16, first down for Jamison Williams, but there's a penalty marker down. We're marching closer to the Tampa end. First foul, face mask, defense over 27. 15 yard penalty, automatic first down. Clutch should have to make the goal. Blue hard. Lions come out, two tight ends, second and goal. 180, Play action, Goff throwing in zone, oh, and it should have been interception. Should have been picked off by Jamel Dean. 180, we set. Third and goal, Montgomery, big hit in the hole to stop him there. In the wild card win, a shorty for 23 yards, and the first points of the game. All the receivers over here to the left, Mayfield, crossing pattern. Bella Fon will try to pull it out, but Evans held on. And Mike is a first down for Tampa, just across midfield. 49, Baker, that quick slant inside. The speedy Trey Palmer takes off to the 22-yard line. Palmer started his career at LSU, then went to Nebraska. Six-round pick. Pressure, Brian Branch has Mayfield and brings him down. This is from 43. And he's got that right down the middle. 180, was that? Second and seven, Gibbs coming to the left, got a terrific block to Springham, almost going a long way. You have a chance against that play action that they do so well. Blitz coming, third and two, Gibbs, great blitz pickup. First down, St. Brown, right at midfield, and the Lions keep the drive going. Two Extra pressure, and got throws in the middle, of Laporta, the tight end. Two more set. Oh, no. 29. Goff throws in the middle to Laporta again. And he's got it for the first down at the 14-yard line. Third and five. Goff. End zone. Touchdown. Josh Reynolds. Lions bring three. Drop eight. Long way to go for Edmonds. Almost got there again. He's about exactly where he was. He's a little bit farther back. He's a full yard short. Easy decisions look easy, but he never it wasn't that way always. I'll just say that. The point of the catch, first down, and a gain of four out of bounds at the 31. Jonah Jackson left guard for the Lions came out on that play. We'll watch that as Goff throws inside, and Laporte is on the run again. Sam Laporte thrown down at the 44. And so far, he has. Quick count, third and ten. Goff keeps driving in the middle. That one not hold on to by St. Brown. Buccaneers, three first downs so far. Mayfield pumps and throws. Got Evans on the sideline. Complete to Mike right around the 35. They needed that hit. Hutchinson coming. Out to White quickly. Great first move. Rashad White gets the first down, but he got hit really hard. McCaffrey and the Niners await the winner of this one in the NFC title game. Mayfield on the boot. This pass complete, getting his tight end. Kate Otten involved, and Otten takes it. Evans down at the bottom against Cameron Sutton. Mayfield throws inside for Godwin, incomplete. 50 even. Third and a long one, really two for the Lions. 
Goff steps up and he's sacked. Brought down first sack of the game, and it's the rookie Kalaja Kansi who gets there. Evans goes to the other side. Mayfield comes back this way towards Palmer, and he caught it inbounds. He should be right at the first down line with that catch. Interesting, it goes. Mayfield keeps. He's got a first down and more as he runs to the 42-yard line. They need another 20 yards or so to be within the range of McLaughlin. Mayfield, sideline shot. In the zone, Evans got it. Breaks away from the tackle, and Mike Evans is out of bounds around the 30-yard line. Just seeing it so quickly. Very much a field goal range here. Mayfield takes a deep shot now for Evans. He's got it. They'll mark him down at the one. He beats Sutton again. Rashad White's the back first and goal. Mayfield to Otten. Flag down. Otten feet down. Let's see if it's a touchdown. There is no foul for offensive pass interference. The contact was in, within one yard of the line of scrimmage. Touchdown. Two scores to turn over a punt in this field goal. Baker Mayfield begins with the 25. Scanning in the middle, he's got Godwin. Chris will take first down to the 37-yard line. Here he comes. It's just window dressing for what's working. It is White. Stop the feet. Restart him. Good run, Rashad White. To the 43-yard line. Gain of 14. And a Buccaneer first down. Third and four. Lines bringing heat. Yep, they are. Mayfield brought down by Hutchinson. He double clutched, and nobody put a body on Hutchinson. Eight sacks in his last four games. Ben Johnson, the offensive coordinator, sends a pass play out and cross it. It's the tight end, Brock Wright. Out of Notre Dame, right into the secondary, all the way to the 24. 30 yards for Wright's longest hit of the year. Brilliant call that time by Ben Johnson. Longest play of the game for either team. Jameer Gibbs with Sewell out blocking. Is that the play you were talking about? That was the play. That uh, was it. There you go. See? Diaby walked off under his own power. It is a first down for the Lions at the 17, trying to take the lead. And Jared Goff throwing on the cross. St. Brown, first down at the five. Montgomery is the back. It's a fake. It's a throw over the top for LaPorta. Too high. Incomplete with Ryan Neal there. And I've seen it in the Super Bowl, too. Fourth and goal. And Craig Reynolds is the running back for the Lions. Goff gives to Reynolds inside. Touchdown, Detroit. There's space for Otten to operate. Pass branch. He's got the first down. First and ten. Another pressure comes. Mayfield hit. He didn't throw it. Kept the play alive. Great job by Baker on the sideline. Oh a my catch gosh. There's by no Otten. way. He can get on a heater. Mayfield stepping up. Dragging it wide open again, it's Otten. He stumbles, but he's not brought down, so that's all good. He gets to the 12-yard line until Vildor brings him down. Third and ten, blitz coming. White tries to beat the blitz, and Rashad White scores a touchdown! The Bucks, their first year in 76, the Lions in 2008. Here they are trying to get to the championship game of the conference. Gibbs out of the backfield for the first down. Off the 42 in the middle of the field again. And it's Reynolds to the 39. Paul coming out. He's back on it. Much on defense. Second and two. Gibbs. Good move to the open field. Gibbs accelerates. Gibbs to the end zone. He's in for the touchdown. Godwin in motion to White. Got away from one. Got away from the other. But not Anzalone. He's going to be short of the first down. Gets all these playoff games. Dean walked off. 
Second and seven for Goff. Steps up, throws underneath the first down for David Montgomery. Across the 25 to the 26-yard line. Killing the box defensively in the middle of the field. Action come into the fullback is in. He protects as Goff fires. Caught right near midfield to Jameson Williams. At the end of practice Friday. Lions last drive is on the field here. Detroit started this drive back to 10. They've taken it out to midfield. Goff is brought down and sacked. What a good job. Twisting in. Can't see it, David. Now it's third and 15. Bucks bring four. Goff's got some time. He's got a receiver. Fighting for it for the first down. Who else but St. Brown? Dad of former Mr. Universe. Powerlifting, big part of the family. St. Brown brings it for the 40 to stay in the air. And caught in the middle by Gibbs. Pulling away is Gibbs inside the 20 yard line. I want the Bucs to be able to substitute in here. They've got something they like out of this group. Gibbs on the run. Bouncing for the first down. First and goal Lions with seven to go. Point out that the backup tight end, Brock Wright, is being checked on. Anthony Ferkser out of Harvard. Sixth year man is the second tight end. Goff looking. St. Brown. End zone. Touchdown Detroit. St. Brown. To stay off. Right. Here's Chris Godwin to the 36 yard line. Angeloni's the pressure man. Mayfield throwing. Couldn't get to Godwin. Gardner Johnson snooping around the line. Pressure comes. Mayfield on the run. Throws Evans. Got it. First down for Evans. Big play by Baker Mayfield. Can they hit one of those shots downfield to one of those speed guys? They're in the game. Mayfield on the out. Caught by the veteran David Moore. 53 to go. Mayfield getting into the rhythm. Got Godwin. Tight window. Mayfield threads it for the first down. On second down. Mayfield in zone. Evans caught it. Touchdown by Evans. The game stays alive with the strong hands of Evans and Mayfield's third touchdown pass of the day. Mayfield for Evans. Melifonwu covering. Wow. No flag, no points. Eight point game. Well, I they got the ball up one with 407. The Rams had one timeout left. The Rams never saw the ball again. And the Lions repeat that. They start with St. Brown. And Amon Ra's on the run for 15 against a depleted Tampa defense. Zion McCollum has played a lot in the absence of the two quarters this year. Remains in. And the Lions are running through the Bucks now. It's Montgomery for a first down. Across midfield to Tampa territory. Eight. Goff. Protected. Throws incomplete. He missed St. Brown there. So the clock stops. At 2.06, they're out of field goal range. They're going to have to punt the ball away. The Bucks are going to get it back with a chance. Here comes that pressure. Mayfield in the middle. It's intercepted. It's Derek Barnes. It's off to San Francisco for the Lions. Mike, you will never be able to say enough about what Dan Campbell has done to the Detroit Lions. You will not be able to say enough. And I think that Sheila Hamp deserves about that same level of praise. They